hello. <laughs> it's um, Saturday, is it Saturday? Saturday, yeah. What's the time? Seven minutes past seven. Seven past seven and I had about two hours sleep. You had a good night's sleep, didn't you? I did, I went to bed at half nine. That's good. I'm half a bit nine. grumpy if I don't have much sleep, so oh, I went a bit of grumpy. I was working last night so I couldn't uh, couldn't have I couldn't get to bed early. But we're just at the airport of Stansted and we're following Lee and uh, Andy. Stansted is absolutely packed. Lee's got his uh, pint at 8am. Start of his holiday with Andy. Oh, oi oi! <laughs> Lisa's got a peppermint tea and it's got a pint and I've got a cappuccino. Very nice mug actually. It's like a big cup. Very nice. Take a picture of the Instagram. Yeah, we're on. We're together. Hello. Hello. So just looking at the fringe book on the airplane. And here's my dad's show, yay! So he's on until the 27th of August. Six pounds, so it's cheap and I think you get um, two for one as well. So we're gonna go and see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. That's obviously not my dad's, that's Frank Carson, but that's his show. Edinburgh Zoo. That looks nice. This is for kids, for children, yeah. So we just had a lovely meal in there. We had pizzas. Very, very nice. Restaurant of the year. Winner! Um, strawberry every time, that one over there. Oh, is it the same raspberry? Oh, the white chocolate Nutella. Wow. Okay, so we just had a really nice meal. We all had huge big pizzas apart from Lee. He had pasta, but I gave him some of my pizza. So we're going back up to the apartment and there is no lie, about 10 or 12 sets of stairs. Sets of stairs? Lots of stairs. So, hello. Working off... Uh, Pizza, so many stairs. Just when you think the stairs are finished, there's more stairs. I'll just show you outside here. Well, I'll wait till I get to the top. See, they're still walking and they're ahead of me. Stairs. In Edinburgh, there's lots of stairs. Right. Keep going. I'm about halfway. Have you? Are you there yet? Yeah. Oh my god. Oh that's where we had dinner. That one there. Here we are. Yay! Right Who's going to have the big bedroom? One bed in there. So there's one in here. That's nice. Two big beds. And what have we got through here? There's a toilet in there. You can have the big room if you want. Yeah, we'll have the other one. What should we toss for it? Uh, <laughs> don't start, Kate. <laughs> Louise has just spotted um, pound savers, so I'll have to have a look in there later on. So we're just off to find some comedy. There's something on at half past two, um, where there's a load of different comedians, and it is um, five to two now, so we're just heading there. And yeah, seeing some comedy. We've had a couple of drinks already, had a lovely meal, and hopefully um, we'll go and find some comedians. We don't know what we're going to see, so we're going to plan what we're doing today, and um, probably see a lot of the late night comedy. Which is always like my favourite bit. So yeah, we're just heading to the venue now. We're looking at the gym. Smell Vlog. 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 Can you smell? Smell it. Smell it. Get him on the vlog. Smell a vlog. He's got a good dance. To be on the vlog. He's showing us all the gym. <laughs> 
I think I'm going to have to show oh, wow, me So it's nice. just like caramelised pineapple oh, and it's, it's the really full percentage nice. as well, so it's not as if it's... Because that's what I don't like, you get a nice I like it like this one. Yeah. And it's... Oh, that's nice. Oh, aye, right, by the way, this one, this one's local. This one's distilled oh. in Leith by one man. He distills it, he bottles it, he stamps the bottles, distributes it to his distributors all on his own. What, um, so what flavour is that one? So this, this is just a straight up gin. Yeah, I don't like right. the It's nice though, the bottle looks nice. I like yeah. the flavour. What's that one, the purple? The is purple one? Uh, no, the, the, this one is Kirsty's gin. I've actually met Kirsty. Yeah, yeah. She, she, yeah, yeah, she bought. No, I don't, I'm not sure. Do you like gin? Yeah, yeah. Do you like gin? I, I, I like mine's a wee bit different though. I drink mine's room temperature, just like whiskey. Do you? Yeah. Oh, just with ice? Oh, oh, yeah. oh rhubarb. You've got rhubarb there. Oh, the rhubarb triangle. That's by the same guys, the boutique gin company that do the spit roasted pineapple. Can I smell that one? Is that the pure can, one? Huh? No, no, no. Got, um, there's a Palma Violet gin, isn't there? It's by these guys, Zimmergorium, but uh, uh, my, my girlfriend drank it all last night. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why. She did what did she drink hers with? Lemonade. Straight up, ice. On its it's own. a liqueur, though, so you can get away with it. Oh, that one there, that, that yeah, yeah. pretty looking one. This one, Escobac. So what's really fun about Escobac, right, is it's not actually a gin, but you drink it like a gin. So it's a modern take on an old school uh, French aperitif. Uh, it's by the guys at uh, Sweet Dram, they, they, they do loads of really cool stuff. But uh, have a smell of it, it's really unusual. I love going to love these bottles. And what do you smell of this? It's pure zesty. I love the bottle. Oh, it smells good. Oh, it smells like um, sweeping lemons. 40% that one. Mm -hmm. Smell. I don't mess about when it comes to my gents. Oh, that smells really nice. Mm -hmm. You're the right and man. And there is a beer that. Uh, Stay here all day, all night. The whole day, all day, all night. <laughs> trying all of them. Um, what about the red top one? What's that one? The red top. These two. Yeah. So these two are pickerings. These are uh, these are distilled are in Edinburgh. Are they? Oh, yeah, yeah. So um, they're not flavoured. Uh, this is your standard, and this one is the 1947, which is the spiced one. I love all Both the of bottles. them. Yeah, Aren't they yeah. Lovely? yeah. Both of them are fantastic. This is uh, what we're going to be in heaven in here. We're both having the same wine and then we're going to try some of the different ones. This is the pub we're in, Usher's, and the man was so nice with all the gins. <laughs> raining a bit so she's got her, her jacket on top of her head. They're getting a show! Oh. They're getting a show! Your face! <laughs> Look at this guy here trying to desperately escape his wife. <laughs> she's just too fast. So I'm a comedian, I like comedy. Everyone look. This is possibly the most dramatic thing I've seen all day. You made it. Congratulations. So, I'm a comedian. Hi, how you doing? So who's copying whose style? Who got the haircut, <laughs> the shoes and the jacket first? <laughs> I need to know your tweets, my arse, you tweets. <laughs> this is my drug dealer, Jeff. How you doing, Jeff? <laughs> you're being clever. See me after the show, you've got the kids, I'm sorry. <laughs> it must be that weekend. <laughs> Hi, sir, how you doing? Do you love your family? then wait for them. <laughs> Let them catch up with you. What the hell happened to your hair? <laughs> Incredible. 
incredible. So it's what I reckon Katie Price would say. Well yeah, do you know what you're around to then? One no, one no. It's a reality show at the end of the day. Yeah, I've not got a problem with that. One no. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, it is just gone nine o'clock and we're drinking more gin, but this time it's from a can. This is Louise's favourite. Yeah, this is so good. This is um, Edinburgh rhubarb and ginger. Um, gin oh, liqueur. Oh, did I say liqueur funny? Liqueur, but um, it's a bit too um, too much for me. It's a bit spicy. Anyway, we are off to um, go and see some more comedy. We've seen loads this afternoon. It's been brilliant. Oh, here's some live music. So, uh, <laughs> I'll probably speak to you in the morning. Louise, Louise is dancing. Good morning, it's Sunday, it's 11 o'clock and um, yeah, it's another drizzly, horrible day outside. But we've got loads planned today. So we're going to go and see my dad's show. So I'll film some of that. We're going to have a cup of coffee with him first of all. And then we're going to go to... Show sir. Oh, hello. Hello. So it's that well, place that um, yeah. we're meeting your dad is yeah. closed on a Sunday. What? It's closed on a Sunday. Oh, the cafe? Cafe on the man. Oh, okay, yeah, give him a call. We'll have to meet him somewhere else. I was, I was just talking about that. Um, but we'll have to meet him somewhere else. And then we're going to go watch his show. And then we've got something for the afternoon. And then we've got... Um, we're seeing comedy at 8 o'clock. A really funny um, com comedian from Finland called Ismo. And we saw a little bit of him yesterday. It was so funny. So we're going to go, we paid to see his whole show. And then we're going to see like the late night com comedy, um, which starts at midnight. And I was so tired last night. We're watching the last comedy. Like there was, um, it was night in the museum and it was like comedy with stuff from the museum. It, wa it wasn't great actually. The, the compare was brilliant, but it, it wasn't Hello. very funny. Hello. Um, and like during it, I was like <laughs> laughing and then like half falling asleep. Um, so yeah, I was really tired last night, but I had a good sleep and then tonight, today we've got lots planned, but we're a lot more, um, like yesterday it was a bit random, we're just going to different things, but today we've got plans, haven't we Lee? Yeah. And Lee got picked on yesterday a couple of times, which was very funny. This is my OOTD. I'm not loving it, but it's Edinburgh. I'm loving it. Uh, are you? Nice. Oh, yeah. Thank you, and it will do. So. And your hair looks on fleek. Thank you. We've just done the hair and makeup. It's pouring with rain. So. Going to curl it later, aren't we? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, Louise is going to curl my hair later. Yeah. So it's quite exciting. But yeah, we're off to see Dad's show now. Wee. Frank Harrison. If I didn't laugh, I'd cry. I had the red, Ellen, hit a cracker. <laughs> I'm ready. It's pouring with rain. We're going to find a breakfast place. Lee's got a pack of mac. Looking good, Sleepy Lou. It's actually, oh, that's nice, Louise. Look at Louise's one. Oh, pretty pattern. <laughs> it's really colour coordinating. Rudy, your hair's gonna get uh, ruined. It's gonna go curly, Andy, your hair. <laughs> We've just come to um, a restaurant bistro cafe called Spoon. And look at these plants. Mr. Carrington would like these. Mr. Carrington, if you're watching, check these plants out. Hello, plants. And flowers. <laughs> I love our tables, look at the map, it's all different places, glasses, very cute. This is my veggie breakfast, and that's my um, flat white, cute little, cute little 
Hello, Louise. Hello. Do you enjoy your Do you know brackies? It? I did yeah, enjoy my brackies. I could have ate oh, it like God. three or four times. Yeah, it wasn't quite enough, was it? Yeah. And Louise has a gripe way. about um, being gluten free. Because although that the sat nap tells you the most direct. When you're gluten free and they um, don't substitute things that are Doesn't then gluten free. So, like for instance, sausages aren't gluten free, but they don't give you something else in place of that. That annoys me a little bit. Yeah. But I'm okay. I'm not going to let it ruin my weekend. The no, easiest way to I explain really is explain what you got for ten pound fifty. Okay, so yeah. for ten pound fifty, I got one slice of gluten-free bread. I got a little teaspoon of baked beans. <laughs> I got one shrieky bit of bacon and one fried egg. I did get two mushrooms, two tomatoes, but I don't like them. So that's all I had, and it was £10.50. But they wouldn't let you swap them. They wouldn't. I asked. I said, I'm gluten-free. Oh, I don't like them. And they wouldn't let me swap Yeah, she them. wanted to swap her tomatoes, yeah. and they said, no, not today. And Lee didn't get bacon, did you? You didn't get bacon on your breakfast? Yeah, I did get bacon. What didn't you get? You said you didn't, didn't get something. I didn't get tomatoes. Oh, Lee didn't get tomatoes. Yeah. Having said that, um, but, you're, you're but it was really tasty. Yeah, it was really, so really, can't really be completely unlike. Yeah, it was really. I really enjoyed it. It was really yeah. tasty. Um, so, but it was. Yeah, it was nice. both quite expensive. But um, yeah, that was the gripe about the gluten free. But it was. Yeah, it was a really yeah. nice breakfast. But Lee didn't get any tomatoes. But then I gave you one of mine. Was that a cat? I think it was. Is that a cat? Are you okay, yeah. hon? Did you do that? Are you okay, hon? <laughs> I was just going to make a comment on the on the bacon. Oh, and you want to get involved? Although it was tasty, it was more Crispy like a, a a scrap of bacon. To, to be fair, the yeah. size of it, it wasn't. Yeah, and it did say big breakfast. It said the big veggie breakfast. So I thought we'll have that, and then we'll be set up for the day. And I would say it was small to yeah. medium veggie breakfast. I'm hungry again now. Yeah, that's good Are for you? breakfast. Yeah. <laughs> we have to go and eat some more. Uh, you use them making me hungry. Oh. <laughs> Where should we go for breakfast then? What did you have for your breakfast? He just said, he just said, um, he hasn't had any we're breakfast. We're making him hungry. Yeah. <laughs> have, you, have you had lunch then? I couldn't care. Oh, oh, you need to eat. Go, 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 go. I need to eat. It's busy. It's busy it's in Edinburgh. So we are off to see Dad's show. We're going to meet him beforehand and have a cup of uh, coffee and then uh, watch his show. So I'll film Dad. He hasn't been on YouTube for ages, has he, Louise? You like watching uh, him, don't I you? I like your dad. I've never actually met him, but I feel yeah. like I've met him because obviously I've watched your vlogs yeah. um, with him in. But yeah, I'm really looking forward to meeting him yeah. and to watching his show. Oh, yay! yay. Dad on YouTube again. Come and sit down, Lee. Hello, how are you doing? Hey. All right. <laughs> Oh, just no, I had Sorry. everything except those Sorry. two things. Dougie's Hi, Dougie. Hi, Kate. Dougie's on vlogging. I'm here. He's on the vlog. Like that every day. Every day. Every day. Yeah. Very hard. Thank you, sir. Louise is here with the tea. Hello. hello. Yeah, I thought I'd really help Kate. Oh, no, hello, hello, Duran. Hello. Hello, Dad. So, what have you got to say? People have missed you. You haven't been on YouTube in ages. No, we'll be on YouTube. No, we'll be on YouTube. Yeah. Do my show, 140. If you're quick enough, you can get down. Two tickets for one, Frank Carson. <laughs> it's a cracker, we ain't telling. <laughs> I'm going to film some of your show today. What? I'm going to film your show. All right, yeah. I think you're in. And when, when are you on until? When's the last day? Uh, 27th of August. Right. So Monday week. <clears throat> Are you enjoying it? Yeah, it's great. You've got you get a good audience. Got a message for your fans? Um, yeah, one forty. Come if you can. Tell them you, tell them you love your fans. Love you, man. I love you, man. I love all my fans. I'm a grease monkey who don't slide. I got a job on the sign. My name is Elvis Presley. Now you remember that. Well, it's one for a money, a two for a show. A three, you gotta run and not go get go. Step in my blue suede shoes. Hey, you can do one of things. Get up in my blue suede shoes. That's all, folks. Bye for now. I'm signing off. Elvis Presley. See you later. Bye now. Here's Dad's show. Uh, yeah. Do you have a right. similar right. setup? I think it's has got Do you have certain people go around to yeah. give you a star right. rating? Yeah. Yeah. Five stars. Everybody's Mike McCabe. <laughs> Another little poster. This is where he's performing. In first place, once again through the door of opportunity, Frank Carson. Thank you very much. Thank you. Come on. Come on. Flying over Belfast, 
One said, quack, quack. The other said, I can't go any quacker. <laughs> That's a quacker. I'm getting you now, eh? You should write, I'm going to have, I said, go back. I'm a black belt in origami. <laughs> he laughed as well. He wasn't laughing when I folded him into a duck. <laughs> I'm alive! <laughs> oh, lovely. Thank you very much. Thank you. There's only a few of you, but you've been absolutely lovely. Now, if you've enjoyed this afternoon, my name is Mike McCabe. If you haven't, it's Jimmy Tarbuck, all right? <laughs> What can I say? You've been a wonderful challenge. Good night. God bless. Good afternoon. Bye bye. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. And it's on the south side now, and off they go now. And the fellow and the other fellow's going on the south side now, and they're about to all go now. They're still sat there. Get out, for Christ's sake. You with the bald head, can you move a bit? Because the light's hitting is blinding me up here. <laughs> Does Dad meet us outside, is he? Oh, is, is it raining? He said in that place. Oh, okay. We just seen Dad's show and it was brilliant. It was so good. We all laughed our heads off and like there was some serious acting as well. Um, and he did it brilliantly. So um, I filmed um, as much as I could, but I just wanted to like enjoy it as well. There's some parts that I didn't film. I'll try and get him. This does a little song and I'll probably get him to do the song when we see it. But yeah, it was brilliant. We laughed our heads off and Andy and Louise, um, and he really enjoyed it as well. So I'm so proud of him. I could have cried. I was watching him thinking, that's my little dad. That's my 70 year old dad up there. And he was brilliant. So yeah, really, really proud of him. And he's going to meet us for a drink in a minute. Should we wait under here? He said bath He's going to meet us now. So I'll, uh, I'll get him to do that song, but yeah, it was fantastic. Really enjoyed it. And if you are here, make sure you go and see him because he's really good. Did you enjoy it? Yeah, I did. Did you enjoy it? Yeah, did you enjoy it? Yeah, very good. Do that little song. I didn't record the song. Everywhere I go, people say, hello, it's a cracker. And walking down the street, people that I meet, sure, it's a cracker. From Peru to Pakistan, Jamaica or Japan, a smile is a language everybody will understand. I hope that everybody in this big wide world will be a cracker like you, that's true. Could be a cracker like you. <laughs> Dad, say goodbye. Beer goodbye. goodbye. Goodbye, YouTube. Goodbye, YouTube. All the best. See you in a few weeks. Bye bye. Well done on your show. You you Brilliant. And um, so, just getting ready. We've come back. Um, it's on my dad's show. I'm gonna go in here. Cause it's they're being noisy. Um, oh, it's too dark in here. Is that all right? I'll go by the window. Um, so yeah, we saw my dad's show, which was brilliant, and then we went to watch Marcus. Birdman. I nearly said Marcus Birdcage, but that would be wrong. And he was fantastic. So we all like laughed our heads off at Marcus Birdman. And then we went for a little drink somewhere, a, a brew dog, brew dog in Cowgate. So we went for a drink there with my dad. And he had his best friend Dougie, who you saw in the vlog earlier on, said hello Dougie. Um, and he watches the vlogs as well. So actually, hello, hi Dougie, if you're watching this one, um, you were in it. I hope you saw yourself, which you probably did. So yeah, right now we are going to, um, we're gonna go and watch Ismo, uh, who is a, a Finnish comedian. I think I said about him earlier on. And then we're gonna go to late night comedy called Spank. And that starts at 12 o'clock. And that'll be on for a few hours. So we've just had a crisp party. We just had loads of crisps and we've got some gin. So we're drinking that and then we're going to go out and um, have more gin and have loads of fun. And look, Louise has done my hair. How nice is that? She just did it in about, I think she took 10 minutes. Oh, towel's drying. Um, she took about 10 minutes to do my hair and I love it. It's really nice. One day I'll learn how to do this because I really like it. So yes, lovely Louise has done this. Um, and I'm um, gonna quickly have a few gins and then off we go. So we're gonna be leaving in about 10 minutes. But um, I'm gonna end the vlog here because we're just gonna go out and watch some comedy and I'm not gonna film anymore because we're gonna go and sit near the front. And when you're near the front, um, it's hard to film because they literally pick on you straight away. It's when you sit further back, you can do some filming. But um, I think we're gonna, we're gonna go to the front, I think, to watch the um, comedy tonight because we want Andy and Lee to be picked on which is always fun, so hopefully they will. Um, they'll be sitting in the front, but maybe they'll pick on us, so we'll have to see. But I'm gonna end this vlog here. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, so this is going on on Monday. Today's obviously Sunday. And what have I got for this week? Poundland for Friday. Um, hopefully I can go to a car boot sale on Wednesday and maybe Thursday and hopefully Friday and Saturday and Sunday. I've got lots of car boot sale um, 
car boot sales to catch up on because I've been wanting for, for so long. So I'm going to go to some of those. I'll also go to some charity shops. I'll probably pop into Home Bargain. So should have some videos and I might do some vlogs as well. So we shall see. But thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, we've had such great fun at the Edinburgh Fringe Festival. Um, my dad was brilliant. So go and watch him if you are in Edinburgh or if you're going to Edinburgh. And he's going to be coming back next year to do the same show. So um, if you are coming back next year, make sure you go and see him because it's the show was brilliant. It was funny. There were some like serious moments and I was so proud of my dad. I could have cried. Wasn't dad good, Lee? He was amazing. He was, wasn't he? Um, right, so I'm going to go. But thank you very much for watching and I will, I'll get them to say a quick goodbye because that's always nice they've been in the vlog um, but thank you for watching and I'll speak to you soon see you later bye thank you if you haven't subscribed yet make sure you do so click it just down there okay see you bye I'll oh, give it a like as well if you want to bye 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 bye, bye. from Andy bye from beautiful Louise thank you for doing my hair I love oh, it I love it so lovely. much it really suits you. thank you and thank you for doing my hair and and being you're on welcome. the vlog thank you Andy and thank you sleepy what, what gorgeous, are you him for? handsome, leapy. Bye! Bye.